All right, now that I'm home and I charged up my phone, it's at 94%. You guys can see, I don't know. Oh well. I should have done something smarter like screen record. <laughs> but uh, anyways, um, since yesterday, I was super unlucky. Um, Vancouver was raining uh, super hard. And um, I didn't have any uh, sheltered event stops, so I had a really rough Indominus Rex starting session. Uh, Ludia pitied me and put an Indoraptor at my house. No, I'm just kidding. I was just lucky enough to have one at my house. Um, uh, usually, it, it, the the one at my house swaps between event stops and um, uh, what do I call it? Strike events. And today, fortunately, it was an event stop. So, um, I don't have to go out for it. Although, today it's not raining outside, so it didn't really matter. <laughs> but, uh, anyways. Uh, let's get into this. Indoraptor. Indoraptor. Okay. So, it's easier this time. Ten. Oh, well. I missed off the three, first three shots. Which are supposed to be the easier ones. Oh no. Yes. Okay. Finally. Uh, 150. I've been restarting this one for a bit and finally got 150. Uh, all right. Uh, I have to swap my team before I go into the arena with this. All right, my level twenty-five Indoraptor. It's twenty-five now. Um, hopefully I could get it to twenty-six. Let's use up all the Indom DNA from yesterday first. Ah, uh, that's not good. No. <laughs> Okay, so 30 to compensate. Alright. Okay. 30? 40? Can I get can I get a 30? Okay, that's four fuses. So far, uh let me do some more um Indominus fuses. Need to get some Indominus DNA. Why can I get this 40 on Indo? Jeez. Ugh. I've been stocking up Velociraptor DNA for a long time. As you guys might tell, I have like, what, 70k or something? Uh, why can't I get the good fuses on it though? Is that too much to ask? Alright, there's a 10 there. Uh, I'll take that. Okay, okay. 30. Alright. Give me a 30. <laughs> 20, all right. 30, 30, 30, 30, come on, 30. Okay. That wasn't horrible. That round, let's, let's do some more. Oh my goodness. I like on this has been horrible. <laughs> Just can't tell. Oh, uh, should have drank some liquid luck before this. Ten. All right, all right, come on, just one more. I wish you could do like mass fusions, especially when doing state ideas. It just takes so long. Okay. All right. If I get a 30, another 10, come on. I haven't gotten a single 30 yet. And I'm what? I'm like 120 DNA in. Come on. 10 on Indom. Watch, watch I get like all 10s on Indom. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. Okay, never mind. It very well can happen. It happened! Jeez. 
Alright, now I could get a 30 on Indo. <laughs> Come on, really? This has to be a joke. Well, finally I can level it up now. Oh, and before I get another 10. Come on, come on. At least 20. Oh, finally. Oh, that took way longer than I expected. Jeez, didn't get a single 30. That was 150 DNA. Didn't get a single 30. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh, well. Anyways, uh, let's, uh, let's talk Indo. So, now that we got this uh, whole Halloween event, this Halloween event, just Basically, you'd call it the Indo event. Just been like, ah, oh. you got Velociraptor, Rex, Indominus, and Indo. It's just been like all the uh, Indoraptor components uh, uh, this week. So, Indo, it's a really good dino. Um, I wouldn't say it's the best. It's it's not really close to the best dino, but it's really good nonetheless. Um, at level twenty six, it has three thousand seven hundred fifty health. Uh, 1,408 uh, damage, 128 speed, 20% crit, and no defense, uh, of course. So, it's not exactly that frail. I mean, it is kind of frail, but um, it does have evasive stance, so that helps it a bit. Also, it has cleansing impact, so that also helps its survivability. Uh, defense sharing to rampage, that's the damage move. Um, you know, two times... Uh, 1.4k, that's 2.4k, uh, or 2.8k damage on the, uh, uh Defense Shire Rampage, also has Arm Piercing Strike as basic move. Um, 128 speed now is a really problematic speed tier, um, it used to be really good, but now we have so many 129 dinos running around, it's problematic. But, uh, anyways, uh, people, you should be start starting to see Indo, like, middle or late sort of marshes, all the way up to, you know, the top. Um, I wouldn't see why someone won't run Indo in their top eight, uh, dinos. Um, it's decently easy to level in comparison to the, you know, other endgame dinos. And it's, it's really good, obviously. Uh, 20% crit, that's a bit overkill, but, you know, it's Indo. So, uh, some counters to Indo. So the, uh, biggest counter is Tiny Glagris. That's the... Um, that's the only guaranteed. Well, it's not even that guaranteed. I, I mean, let me see. So if it strikes turn one, then you, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's Titanic Lagris is a guaranteed kill on Indo. If you cloak on turn one, turn two, it doesn't really matter. Um, you're still going to get killed. So Titanic the only guaranteed Indo killer. Other than that, there really isn't any more guaranteed Indo killers in the game. Um, as far as I know, um, there are some dinos that do okay with Indo. Uh, Indominus Rex, for example, that has a 50% chance of killing Indo. Uh, Erlodom has a 50% chance of killing Indo. Um, what else? Wait, does Erl- Oh, Erlodom barely survives. Yes, it, it has a chance to kill Indo. Am I calculating this right? Yeah, it has, it, Erlodontus have a 50% chance of killing Indo. And some other dinos, uh, Stegosaurus has a decent chance of killing, it's like 30, 37%, I think, uh, or something, I can't really remember. Um, Mono Stegothops has an okay-ish chance to kill Indo. It really depends on, you know, if you null on turn one or slow on turn one, and depends on if Indo cloaks on turn one, or, or not cloaks, dodges. Or not on turn one, um, but usually, I mean, I personally, I do the Indo Mono Stegosaurus matchup all the time. I personally haven't lost a single. I no no no. Actually, I have lost some Indo Mono Stegosaurus matchups when I'm using Indo, but uh, usually I, I win most of them. So, uh, it, it's it's a really fifty fifty for Mono Stego. Um, it's kind of risky, but. Uh, if you don't have anything else better to fight Indo with, um, Mono Stego is a good option if you have that on your team. Uh, Stego Dias has an okay-ish chance. I mean, like, these are kind of like... 
Sega DS is kind of stretching it. Like, there really aren't any... Like, theoretically, Endo can beat every single dino in the game one-on-one, -on -one, except for uh, Tiny Clivers. And that's really good. That's really good. But, um, you know, always you could have that really bad luck and get absolutely screwed <laughs> but uh, by RNG. But I'm just accounting for, you know, uh, really uh, 50%, just your normal uh, average percentages. Uh, it, it does decently well. Um, Dialor Kyrus, Spontasuchus, uh, Puritator, these all do well against uh, Indo. Um, some dinos that don't do really well against Indo uh, are um, like Trico. Trigodistus doesn't do well. Uh, Triostronics, like those slower dinos without too much um, control. And... Uh, not too much HP, like Trigo. Trigo doesn't have too much HP. Um, are gonna get screwed by Endo, <laughs> unfortunately. And Kencho does really well against Endo, but this is a super uh, tricky matchup. You'll have to, you know, you'll have to work that one out, uh, out by yourself because it really depends on what kind of player you're facing. It could either go really good or absolutely horribly. Uh, I once played a matchup against like a level 24 endo and I was a level 20 and Kendra with half half health and I absolutely obliterated the endo I just predicted every single move it was it was such a satisfying game for me um it works really well if you use it right um so uh, oh I want to touch on the Trago endo matchup for a bit so uh, usually I see a lot of people cloaking against Tragodistus and I'm not sure why since you do have, you, you're a guaranteed kill against Trigodistus if you just go uh, Impact and uh, a Rampage. Of course, you're going to take a lot of damage. So for going for Cloak, you're gambling not losing too much HP in exchange for a chance of getting killed by Trigodistus. So I don't know why people will do that. And obviously, um, if you are the Trigo player and Indo goes uh goes for a cloak you should start with rampage and that uh gets that gives you a higher chance of actually beating into instead of the alternative which if they don't cloak then you're screwed <laughs> but uh anyways that's uh, that's just a little about uh indoraptor um some really decent counters uh people are gonna have it a lot now obviously now since um uh, uh, we've got so many components for it available this past i'd say two weeks last week we had some howling sense that helps a lot and yeah it's probably could be most people's first unique dino it's not that hard to create um it's not hard to level up uh it's you know as long as you di don't divert too many resources to other things like trico or uh erlodom oh by the way if you're wondering if you want to uh, go for Erlodom or level up Indo. I, I'd say level up Indo. Erlodom, I really don't think it's that great of a dino. Um, it has a lot of problems. Uh, it, uh, it's, it's not, it's not bad of a dino, but there are really better alternatives, and I'd rather prefer have a level, or higher level Indo instead of Erlodom. Indo is probably, um, it's kind of like a requirement if, for uh, higher tier arenas, and now that you know people in lower middle tier arenas got them, and that's that's gonna um, be problematic for those who don't have it. Um, they're gonna have a rough few days in the arena, but after those guys climb up, um, the lower arena should be back to normal again. And uh, this gives a boost to everyone with Indo without Indo. Well, obviously, except for those who already have max level Indos. Um, I guess they could skip today. <laughs> uh, but anyways, uh, that's all for today. Um, 150 on Indo. I'm personally uh, satisfied with that. Uh, could have gotten more or ah, who knows. But uh, anyways, I uh, hope you guys all did nice on Indo. Uh, next week, we're getting Kencho and stuff and Tojango, which is nice, but uh, not a momentous week. Although some may argue next week's dinos were, are better than this week's, but, you know, it's not fun when you don't have Legendaries and uh, Uniques there. And uh, nothing special next week, not Halloween. Um, Hopefully we get Patch Notes next week. That will be really, really hype. 
but I'm not counting on it. Uh, oh, one more thing. Next week, um, the 6th, November the 6th, that's midterms election. I'm not sure if I could gonna upload on, I might just be watching TV all day, but, um, aside from that, uh, Arc Extinction is coming out, and that's gonna be really hype, I'm gonna play that, um, uh, I might upload some gameplay of that, uh, I'm not sure, uh, probably will, I'd say, like, it's just so hype at the moment, I've, I've seen the, uh, maps and stuff, it looks so cool, the, uh, the Titans stuff, oh, I, I can't wait to dive into that one, but anyways, I'll see you guys uh, a bit later, I might upload something else, I might not, who knows, but, uh, anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching, and have fun!